Hello friends, today we're going to draw a cat in the hat. The original painting was created by the artist Julian Charton. Today we are learning from him how to draw adorable cats. This cat looks quite surprised. When you're very surprised, your eyes will widen. So let's start by drawing its round big eyes. Connect your eyes for its head. Next, draw a small arch as his hat. Now let's add its ears. Did you know that cats have a remarkable ability to rotate their ears 180 degrees? This makes them highly effective hunters. These cat ears look like two little goat horns. Let's draw a curve for his chubby face. Add a little V for his little nose. Now it looks like an owl. Did you know that every cat's nose is unique? Each cat has a different pattern on its nose, just like in human fingerprint. Now let's add whiskers. Let's add a few more details to its hat. The hat is done. Let's move on to its body. Its body leans to the right side. Its body is all straight lines. Very easy to draw. Add a few stripes to its body. Now we've finished drawing the cat in the hat. Let's color it in. You can design the pattern of the hat and choose the color of your cat. If you need more time, feel free to pause the video. Did you know that cats have eyes that can see really well in the dark? Almost like they have built in night vision goggles. It helps them sneak around and catch things when it's dark aside. Cats are naturally nocturnal animals. Nocturnal animals are creatures that love to come out and play when it's dark outside, like when you're getting ready for bed. By this definition, my brother is a nocturnal animal. All right, mom's cat is done. Now it's my brother's turn. The way he draws a cat is totally different from mom. It looks like the abstract art style of the 20th century. Well, actually, I don't even know what it means. I'm just reading my scripts. Let me get AI to explain more. Abstract art is like a colorful, magical world where artists use shapes, lines, and colors in a special way that might not look like things you see every day. Exactly. I don't see this cat every day. Well done, Marco. Now, it's my turn. Have you ever seen a pink and purple cat? It's very unique. She's wearing a purple sweater. My grandma knitted me a lot of sweaters since I was little. Actually, she knitted me a lot of things such as hats, scarves, gloves, pants, and even toys. She's a great knitter. If we had cat, I'm sure she would need a sweater to the cat too. Once, our neighbor's cat visited our house. Mom gave her milk. Dad was worried about our sofa, but he didn't dare to do anything because she is a Norwegian forest cat with six toes and can fight fox. Yippee! Our cat family is done! We hope you liked this video. See you next time. Bye!